Coming up on Connections at 12 noon on Sunday and 6 p.m. Eastern Time on KET2, the new dean of the University of Kentucky's College of Education. He's an award-winning leader, teacher, researcher, and voice for equity in education in the U.S. and globally. He came to U.K. in 2019 from California State University, where he was a professor of educational leadership and policy studies. We're talking about Dean Vasquez Heilig, who's been an author or co-author of nearly 50 peer-reviewed journals and written extensively on a range of topics, including racial equity and teacher preparation. We're glad that we're going to get to some of those topics when we talk to you for the full half hour. Thank you, Dean, for being with us. I'm looking forward to doing it. Yeah, so thank you for joining us and talking to us all about all the myriad of issues facing public education right now. And just in the couple of minutes we have, why do you say this is a great time to want to be a teacher? It's a great time to want to be a teacher because education really is the compass of our democracy. Our teachers are the first responders to the social issues in our country. And so there's an opportunity for you uh, as an educator, to leave a lasting legacy, not just for that student, but for their family and for generations after that. And there's very few professions uh, that offer that opportunity. Yeah, and you also talk about the intersectionality of social justice and education. Can you give us the Reader's Digest version of how that comes to be? Well, I mean, social change um, is comes forth from the work that educators do with all the different stakeholders, whether they be parents, community members, nonprofits, et cetera. Um, and it's important that educators are a part of that coalition of stakeholders that moves our nation to a place where uh, people of all different backgrounds, diversity of all different types, fill a welcome space in our state and in our nation. Do you feel that public education has been devalued or that the public perception is even higher of educators during this time? Well, I think for, um, to be frank with you, for a long time, uh, the challenges in education were blamed on children. Mm -hmm. uh, and then that onus changed to low performing schools. And then in the last decade or so, we started to blame educators for those challenges. But what those challenges really represent are the instability of poverty in children's lives. Mm -hmm. And now we know we need to provide wraparound services. We need to provide high quality education, small class sizes, and uh, all the other things that we know from the research literature that make a difference. And educators are a center of that ecology. Yeah. So you're going to get a lot more wisdom from Dean Julian Vasquez Highly coming up on Connection Sunday at 12 noon Eastern Time on KET, the main channel. And you can watch it again, 6 p.m. Eastern Time on KET2 and online anytime after that, KET.org slash connections. I hope you'll join us.